trouble finding a new job, AI may be to blame. In today's video, we will delve into an intriguing subject that revolves around AI. Artificial intelligence is not just an upcoming, it's already modifying our lives, particularly if you're on a job hunt. Hilke Shellman, in her profound work, The Algorithm, how AI decides who gets hired, monitored, promoted, and fired, and why we need to fight back now, explores the extent to which AI has infiltrated in scrutinizing resumes, conducting interviews, keeping watch on employees, and much more. She discusses the potential of such technology to uphold bias and questions its effectiveness in helping employers recruit the best fit for job. Role of AI in employment processes. AI is more than a futuristic notion. It's an influential player in the job market, its role being crucial in filtering resumes, conducting interviews, keeping track of employees, and performing other HR-centric tasks. Scope of AI in hiring. AI finds extensive application in the recruitment procedure, including the use of algorithms to sift through resumes, analyze applicants' profiles, and even carry out virtual interviews. The application of AI in job-seeking processes is turning into the new normal. Biases in AI. The potential for bias in AI algorithms used in the recruitment process is a significant concern. Hilke Shellman delves into how these algorithms can extend biases that exist in the data they are trained on, leading to discriminatory outcomes favoring certain groups over others. Effectiveness and challenges. The effectiveness of AI in employers to find the right candidates for the job is put under the microscope. The discussion also throws light on whether AI, despite making processes more efficient, might overlook certain vital qualities crucial for a candidate's success. Call for action. The phrase why we need to fight back now in the books hints at the need for proactive measures against the negative impacts of AI in hiring. The need for awareness, regulatory measures, and ethical considerations to ensure fair and unbiased employment practices is emphasized. In a nutshell, the video explores how AI's influence on job-seeking procedures, particularly in hiring, is significant and discusses its potential biases and effectiveness. It underscores the importance of vigilance and proactive steps to address these concerns in the AI-dominated employment practices era. AI's growing presence in screening resumes and identifying potential suitable is worth noting. Here are some insights into how AI is employed in this process. Automated resume. Parsing. AI can automatically parse and extract relevant information from resumes. This includes details such as education history, work experience, skills, and qualifications. This automation aids in quickly organizing and categorizing a large volume of resumes. Keyword matching. AI algorithms often utilize keyword matching to spot resumes that contain specific terms or skills relevant to the job description. This is an efficient way to filter out resumes that do not meet the basic criteria for a certain position. Natural Language Processing, NLP. NLP algorithms empower AI systems to comprehend and analyze the natural language used in resumes. This allows for a more detailed assessment of candidate qualifications and experiences beyond mere keyword matching. NLP assists in identifying context and understanding the meaning behind sentences. AI's influence isn't just limited to futuristic movies. It's also playing a critical role in the hiring process. Imagine a world where a computer program, not a human, sifts through your resume, gauges your qualifications, and even conducts your interview. Welcome to the present. Skill and Experience Assessment AI tools can assess the skills and experiences listed on a resume against the requirements of a job. This goes beyond mere keyword matching and involves a more in-depth analysis of the candidate's proficiency in specific areas. Predictive Analytics Some advanced AI systems use predictive analytics to evaluate a candidate's potential success in a role. By analyzing historical data on successful hires and the performance of employees, these systems attempt to predict which candidates are likely to be the best fit for a particular position. Bias. Mitigation. To address concerns related to bias, some AI tools are designed to be aware of and actively mitigate biases in the hiring process. This involves regular monitoring, adjustments to algorithms, and ongoing efforts to ensure fairness and diversity in candidate selection. Continuous learning. AI systems used for resume screening often incorporate machine learning capabilities. 
This means that these systems can continuously learn and improve over time based on feedback and new data. This adaptability helps in refining the screening process and making it more effective. Bias. Mitigation. AI systems are not inherently unbiased. Rather, they reflect the biases present in the data they were trained on. If historical data used to train AI models contains biases, the model may perpetuate and even amplify those biases when making decisions, such as in the case of resume screening. Here are some key points to consider. Training data bias. If the training data used to teach AI models is biased, the AI system may learn and reproduce those biases. For example, if historical hiring practices favored certain demographics, the AI might unintentionally favor similar profiles when reviewing resumes. Implicit biases in job descriptions. Biases can also emerge from the language used in job descriptions. If historically biased language is present in job postings, AI algorithms may inadvertently reinforce those biases when assessing resumes against such criteria. Lack of context. Understanding. AI, as of now, may struggle to understand context and nuance in the same way humans do. This could lead to misinterpretation of information on resumes, potentially impacting the accuracy of candidate assessments. Over-reliance on historical patterns. AI models often rely on historical patterns to make predictions. While this can be useful, it may also perpetuate existing inequalities and fail to adapt to changes in societal norms or evolving job requirements. Ongoing efforts for bias. Mitigation. Recognizing these challenges, there are ongoing efforts within the AI community to develop techniques for mitigating biases. This includes strategies like regular audits of AI models, diverse training data, and the implementation of fairness-aware algorithms. Transparency and accountability. Increasing transparency in AI decision-making and holding developers and organizations accountable for addressing biases are crucial steps in ensuring fair and ethical AI practices. It's important for organizations using AI in hiring processes to be aware of these potential biases and take steps to mitigate them. Regular audits, diverse training data sets, and ongoing monitoring are critical aspects of responsible AI deployment. Additionally, considering AI as a tool to support human decision-making rather than a replacement for it can help strike a balance between efficiency and fairness in the hiring process. But does AI's involvement in hiring come without concerns? Let's explore. As we venture deeper into the world of artificial intelligence, we encounter a possible pitfall, biases. Yes, you heard that right. Algorithms, as unbiased as they may seem, can actually perpetuate biases that exist in the data they were trained on. This is a significant concern in the hiring process, as it could lead to discriminatory outcomes, favoring certain demographics over others. Take this example from Hilke Shellman's research. She found that an AI system, trained on a data set dominated by male candidates, ended up favoring men over women. The algorithm was simply mirroring the patterns it had learned from the data. It wasn't consciously biased, but it reflected the biases inherent in its training data. Or consider another scenario. Suppose an algorithm is trained on data from a company that has historically favored applicants from certain universities. The AI system might then develop a bias towards candidates from those institutions, potentially overlooking equally qualified applicants from other schools. These examples highlight a fundamental issue the AI systems we're using in hiring processes are only as good as the data they're trained on. If the data is skewed, the AI's decisions could be skewed too. And this isn't just a hypothetical concern. Research has shown that biased AI systems can and do lead to discriminatory outcomes, like disproportionately rejecting candidates from certain racial or ethnic groups. But it's not only about the data. The design of the algorithms themselves can subtly introduce bias. For instance, if an algorithm is designed to prioritize certain qualifications that are more common among certain demographics, it could inadvertently favor those groups. So what does this mean for the job market? Well, it means we have work to do. As we continue to integrate AI into our hiring processes, we need to be vigilant about these potential biases. We need to ensure that our algorithms are trained on diverse and representative data and that they're designed with fairness in mind. While technology advances, it appears we must also grapple with its potential to perpetuate existing biases. 
Despite its widespread use, questions remain about AI's effectiveness in the hiring process. You see, artificial intelligence in all its algorithmic glory has a knack for crunching numbers, sifting through data, and identifying patterns faster and more accurately than any human could. But can it truly grasp those intangible qualities that make a candidate stand out? Imagine for a moment, a candidate who may not have the exact qualifications listed on the job description, but possesses a unique blend of creativity, resilience, and adaptability. These characteristics can't be quantified. They can't be measured by an algorithm. Yet, they could be the very qualities that contribute to a candidate's success in a particular role. On the other side of the coin, we have the challenges of relying heavily on AI for hiring decisions. For one, there's the risk of over-reliance on technology. Like any tool, AI is only as good as the hands that wield it. If employers lean too heavily on AI, they may overlook the human touch, the gut instinct, and the personal interaction that are so crucial in the hiring process. Then there's the issue of transparency. Algorithms, by their very nature, are complex and often opaque. It's difficult, if not impossible, for a candidate to know why they were rejected by an AI system. This lack of transparency can lead to frustration and mistrust among job seekers. Lastly, we cannot ignore the potential for errors. Algorithms are created by humans, and humans, as we all know, are not infallible. An error in coding or a bias in the training data can lead to unfair hiring practices. As we navigate this new digital landscape, we must remember that technology, while helpful, is not infallible. It's a tool, a resource, and a means to an end, but it should never replace the human touch in the hiring process. But should we accept this AI-driven reality without question? Shellman suggests otherwise. The rise of artificial intelligence in the job market is, without a doubt, a double-edged sword. On one side, it's an innovative tool that streamlines the hiring process, making it more efficient and less time-consuming. On the other side, it's a potential breeding ground for biases and discrimination, capable of masking these issues under the guise of machine neutrality. The dialogue surrounding AI isn't about rejecting its use outright. Instead, it's about harnessing this technology responsibly. It's about understanding that while AI has the potential to revolutionize the job market, it's not a magic bullet that can solve all our hiring woes. Shellman's call to action is a clarion call for awareness, regulation, and ethical considerations. Awareness, because we need to understand the potential pitfalls of relying too heavily on AI. Regulation, because we need rules and guidelines in place to ensure that AI is used responsibly and ethically. And ethical considerations, because we need to remember that behind every resume and job application is a real person with hopes, dreams, and aspirations. Take, for example, a hiring algorithm that has been fed data favoring candidates from elite universities. This algorithm, absent of regulation and ethical considerations, could perpetuate a cycle of privilege, effectively shutting out potentially great employees who simply didn't have the means to attend such institutions. Or consider an AI system designed to monitor employee productivity. Without proper guidelines, such a system could lead to an invasive work culture where employees feel constantly surveilled and under pressure. As we step into this brave new world of AI-driven hiring, we must not forget the human element. We must not lose sight of the fact that hiring is not just about filling a vacancy. It's about finding the right person for the job, someone who will contribute to the company's culture and growth. The future of work is here and it's powered by artificial intelligence. But it's up to us to ensure that this future is inclusive, fair, and unbiased. As we embrace the conveniences of AI, we must also strive to ensure it promotes fair and unbiased employment practices. In this journey, we've explored the significant ways AI is influencing our job-seeking experiences. From sifting through countless resumes to conducting virtual interviews, artificial intelligence is becoming an integral part of the employment process. It's not a distant futuristic concept, but a present reality shaping our opportunities and challenges. We've seen how AI is not just a tool, but a game changer in the hiring process. It's revolutionizing how employers find potential candidates, making the process more efficient and in many ways more objective. 
Yet with this efficiency, we've also encountered potential pitfalls. One major concern we've delved into is the bias inherent in AI algorithms. As investigative journalist Hilke Shellman's book, The Algorithm, How AI Decides Who Gets Hired, Monitored, Promoted, and Fired, and Why We Need to Fight Back Now, highlights, AI doesn't exist in a vacuum. It is trained on data that might carry historical biases, potentially perpetuating discriminatory outcomes. With AI's increasing role in hiring, we've also questioned its effectiveness. While it can certainly streamline processes, there's a risk of missing out on the intangible qualities of candidates, those that can't be quantified or captured in an algorithm. It's a reminder that although AI can provide invaluable assistance, it can't replace human intuition and judgment. Lastly, we've emphasized the need for action. The increasing use of AI in employment practices calls for awareness, regulation, and ethical considerations. We need to ensure that this powerful tool is used in a way that promotes fairness and opportunity for all. In this video, we have seen that predictive analytics models are trained on historical data, and if that data contains biases, the model may inadvertently perpetuate or even amplify those biases. This could lead to discriminatory outcomes, favoring certain demographics or penalizing others based on historical patterns. Limited context. Understanding. Predictive models might lack the ability to fully understand the context of a candidate's experiences and achievements. Some qualities such as cultural fit, adaptability, or collaboration skills may be challenging for a model to assess accurately without a nuanced understanding of the specific job requirements. Overemphasis on historical patterns. Predictive models rely on historical patterns to make predictions about future success. However, the job market and workplace dynamics are constantly evolving. Over-reliance on historical data may not account for changes in industry trends, emerging skills, or shifts in the importance of certain qualifications. Inability to capture soft skills. Predictive analytics models may struggle to effectively capture and assess soft skills, such as communication, leadership, and emotional intelligence. These skills are often crucial for success in a role, but may not be easily quantifiable or detectable from resume data alone. Unintended consequences. Reliance on predictive analytics might lead to unintended consequences, such as overlooking unconventional candidates who could bring valuable perspectives to a team. The emphasis on predictive metrics may inadvertently exclude individuals with diverse backgrounds or non-traditional career paths. Lack of transparency. Some predictive models operate as black boxes, making it challenging to understand the specific factors contributing to a decision. Lack of transparency can hinder accountability and make it difficult to address issues related to bias or fairness. Privacy concerns. The use of predictive analytics may involve collecting and analyzing large amounts of personal data. Organizations must be mindful of privacy concerns and ensure that they comply with relevant data protection regulations to protect candidates' sensitive information. Resistance and trust issues. Employees and candidates may resist or distrust the use of predictive analytics in hiring decisions. Lack of transparency, concerns about fairness, and fears of automation replacing human judgment can contribute to resistance from both candidates and existing employees. To mitigate these dangers, it's important for organizations to approach predictive analytics with caution, regularly audit their models for bias, ensure transparency in decision-making processes, and complement automated assessments with human judgment. Striking the right balance between technology and human insight is crucial for ethical and effective use of predictive analytics in resume review and hiring processes. Thanks for watching. Please comment, share, and subscribe. Bye bye. Thank you.